All right, it's time. For the last two years, we've been priming people, explaining what the vision of One Cairo is, explaining what we're trying to do, trying to bring the tribe together. Well, now it's time to accelerate the mission. And today, I'm going to talk to you about what that mission is and how you need to be involved in it. Hey, everybody. Welcome to another incredible week in the world of chiropractic. So, you know, it's kind of time. We've got to start accelerating this mission. You know, we've been talking for a long time about the stance that one chiropractic has, which is making sure that the adjustment is the primary service in the chiropractic practice and that we do not ever expand the scope to include drugs and surgery. But within the middle of that, there's a lot of stuff that needs to happen to start inspiring our profession. So we're amping up the mission and it's time to start inspiring. We believe as an organization that the majority of our profession is looking for something and someone to believe in. We don't have have those pillar leaders that we used to have back in the day when you think through people like Reggie Gold or Sid Williams or you know you look at back with the the Wilkes case and and Dr. Sportelli and all of these other people that you know were figureheads that people could rally behind there's just not much of that anymore and so therefore this is why we have the reality that the majority of the profession doesn't belong to any organization whether it's their state or national and they're just hibernating they get out of school they go into practice and it's just about survival Mode and they live in their own little world. And that's got to stop. As a profession, we cannot allow ourselves to be as segmented as we are. So we're amping up the mission. I mean, we are going to start revving up and getting out there and saying things and doing things that start to inspire people. And that first thing that we're inspiring is it's time to stop all the political BS. It's time to stop arguing over the things that ultimately don't matter. And I'm not against lobbying. I spent six years doing it for the Ohio State Chiropractic Association, and it is a necessary evil. I get it. But to put all of our time and energy and money into something that oftentimes doesn't produce a result, and when it does, it just takes another piece of legislation to drop it off, is asinine. You look at the amount of money that's spent from associations across the country on lobbying. If we could take that money on advertising, do you have any idea what would happen? We need to start stepping up. One Chiropractic has a mission. Our mission is to create cultural authority. Our mission is to harness the power of our patients, to increase the value of the adjustment, to increase access for every living, breathing human being in the world to chiropractic. That's our mission, and that's not going to happen legislatively. That's only going to happen when we create a movement amongst our general population, and they start demanding access. They start demanding that their doctors are paid better. They start demanding that their doctors are considered authority so that we can be the leaders within corporations and sports teams and all the different facets of healthcare that currently the MDs and the DOs own. People, this only happens when we rise up together as an organization. Our vision for One Chiropractic was to grab as many people as we could that had a similar vision, ask them to pay just a little bit, $33 a month, and together as a large group, we could financially move and create movements from a marketing perspective that have never happened in our profession. And that's what we're asking. So we are starting to move. Our new website design is part of that, getting out there and working with state organizations and helping them change their vision and their strategy to go to more of a marketing vision rather than a legislative vision. We are starting to create that across the profession, but it's time that you guys jump up and get involved. Those of you watching this video that are not contributors, that are not tied to our organization, I'm asking you to please do that. Please jump on board with us. We're at that pinnacle point where we now have the opportunities. What we lack is the resources to be able to take advantage of them. As we're partnering with more states, we're getting introduced to more people that can make things happen, but we're now starting to be limited by our ability to do so, and we need more people jumping on board. I'm not going after the big corporations with thousands and thousands of dollars. I'm asking a little bit from a lot of people, and more importantly, I'm asking more people to join the tribe because numbers are what's going to get this done. More people watching these videos, more people learning the vocabulary, more people going out and sharing that vocabulary in their communities is what's going to get this done. So I'm not asking for a lot from you. All I'm asking you to do is start spreading the word and let people know that there is an organization that's put their flag in the ground saying we will not stop until chiropractic is the number one healthcare choice in the world. You have my commitment until I no longer have a breath, we will make sure that chiropractic is utilized appropriately in this world. I love you. Join the mission. It's time to rev up. It's time to amp up what we're doing so that we can make a greater impact in the world around us. The time is now and you're the key. I love you. Have a great week. <laughs>